Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today we will solve week 4 problem solving through programming in C assignment. In question number 1, it says that in the C program AND is used in scanf to indicate memory locations. This is the correct options. In the second question, it says that the control slash uh, conditional statement used in C is a that is option C both A and B that is if else statements and switch uh, statements in question number three it is says that what is the other statement that can avoid multiple nested if condition that is uh, if else statements with back in the question number four it says that uh, the loop which is executed at least once that is uh, do while loop okay in question number five it says that a equals to one or b equals to two can be written as in the statement it says that a or b equals to two that means if this condition is true then the code will execute otherwise if this condition uh, is true the code will execute so um, if any of this uh, two uh, condition is true both for both case the code will execute so the correct option is uh, b in question number 6 uh, it says that what will be the output of the following code that is x int x y equals to 5 so this is the variable y which contains 5 and this is the variable z which contains 5 and this is the variable x so here x uh, y equals to z that means it is true obviously it is true so when uh, in c programming the value of true is always 1 so 1 will assign to x so print a percentage d comma x so the output will be 1 so option b is correct in question number 7 it says that which statement is correct for the following lines okay so the output will be uh, it will give a compilation error okay because uh, uh, it is not defined temperature in celsius so in the code uh, it is not defined then uh, uh, obviously it is uh, so it will give a compilation error in question number 8 it says that what will be the output of the given program okay so float num equals to 5.6 switch num in the switch uh, statement float number is not allowed so it will obviously so compiler error so option b is correct in question number 9 it says that what will be the value of abc of the execution of the following so a equals to 5 b equals to 7 and c equals to 1 1 1 okay so first we find the value of this expression pre increment a that's mean the value will be now 5 plus 1 that is 6 so plus a into b <coughs> post decrement means the value of b first assigned in the expression after execute this expression then the value of b will uh, decrement uh, by 1 okay so the value of this expression will be uh, 6 into the value of b is 7 that is 42 okay so c equals to c by 42 then the value of c will be c equals to 111 by 42 and that will be 2 okay so the value of a after execution of the following code the value of a will be 6 value of c will be 2 and value of b will be because after execution of this code the value of b will decrement uh, by 1 okay so this is the answer 
सो ऑप्शन सी इज करेक्ट सिक्स सिक्स टू इन क्वेश्चन नंबर टेन इट सेज दैट वॉट विल बी द आउटपुट ऑफ द फॉलोइंग प्रोग्राम ओके सो द वेरिएबल ए कॉन्टेंट जीरो एंड द वेरिएबल बी कॉन्टेंट टेन इन द कोड इट सेज दैट इफ ए इक्वल्स टू जीरो सो इफ ए इक्वल टू जीरो दैट्स मीन इट इट इज जीरो दैट्स मीन इट इज फॉल्स सो दिस कोड विल नॉट एग्जीक्यूट सो फॉल्स विल प्रिंटेड सो ऑप्शन बी इज करेक्ट veins i've been driving this train years in this lane there's no stop in this flame cuz i came to the game and i changed it to play how i like rearranged it to my own domain yeah